Hi, this is Ross from ProTech Epoxy Floors. Today we're starting a two car with baseboard in Wesley Chapel. And right now we're well into the job. This is the results of the coating removal. And that's also cutting the cap. Right now is actually a good time to stop. Put a little segment here to show you what we're actually doing. So now that is really just beating up the cap and giving us a good place to come back and do the final grind. Now in a second, I'll come back and we'll see the tool change over. So you can get a better understanding of what we're doing. Right now we have PCD tooling on here, which is gonna remove the coating. And that's putting that odd looking swirl cap on the floor. But we're gonna come back and we're gonna do a profile grind. Here's the results of prepping the baseboards. These, these baseboards needed a lot of prep. You can see back here kind of what it looked like throughout. We're going to get back there and just finish that up. So we're going to fill the control joints. There's also cut lines on the baseboard that we're going to fill too. And you'll see that in the next segment when we're using the thickening compound patch to hold the verticals. So we're going to clean up this lead in edge. And so now what Chuck is doing now, he's changing the tools over from the from the coating removal tools. And he's going to put diamond tooling on here and diamond tooling is what's going to give us the final profile. So these tools you can see, there are two segments on the plate. And that's a metal bond that holds the diamonds in it. So you're going to see the results of all this in just a sec. This segment shows the result of the diamond grinding. And you can see there's a really good profile on this concrete. You can see all those little holes. So what that's going to do is we're going to put our epoxy on this floor. And it's going to cure for eight hours and it's literally going to get into the concrete. Now this is the second step again where we're diamond tooling the floor and what that is doing as you just saw it's removing the rest of the cap and the rest of the coating and it's giving us a really good profile to put our epoxy. There's still a lot of material that's coming off this floor and that's what we're looking to do. We're just looking to get back down to the bare concrete. So here's the prep that's almost complete now. So the grind is done, we've cleaned up, we're doing the patches, we filled the control joints for a seamless surface. Lauren is putting an epoxy primer on the baseboards. Along here you can see all the repairs that we made into the baseboards. That's what Chuck is still working on. This epoxy, is, this patch is thickened so it clings to the vertical. Here's the prep on the lead and edge. We're going to get this floor in in just a few minutes. Here's the final result of our project. Job looks great. Baseboards look really, really good. A lot of work went into them, a lot of details to get them flush and the voids filled. A lot of additional material needed to be removed. Follow the first course of block. That's what that looks like. Here's some details around the fixture. Again, what those baseboards look like. As you saw in the previous segments, we removed a lot of material off this floor. We got rid of the original coating. We got rid of the cap, got back down to bare concrete. Had a really good profile on this floor. Put that profile on the floor, 
so that our epoxy has something to cure into. So the epoxy doesn't sit on the floor, it gets into the floor. So that's how we know it's never going to delaminate. Another look at the baseboard over there. We had to remove a lot of uh, material. Let's kind of profile that up. Here's the lead in edge, squared up and rounded over. So we have a seamless floor because we filled the control joints. This is a durable UV stable polyaspartic top coat. There's some more details. This color is dolphin. Job looks great. Thanks for watching. Pro Tech Epoxy Floors, Newport Ritchie, Florida. We professionally install beauty and durability. Pro Tech serves both residential and commercial customers in Pasco, Hernando, Hillsborough, and Pinellas counties. Please call or text 727 916 2314 to discuss your project. We look forward to being of service. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, or subscribe.